you kittens. We're back with the special, very special Wizards Unite Halloween event called Halloween Halloween. Where we get to face off the slither and terrifying basilisk. <coughs> While I talk about the Halloween event, I will have some footage of me finishing the special assignment. Thank you, Niantic, for fixing everything for me. I've been having issues playing. Uh, see, that's supposed to be like that. Whoops. So obviously, we are going to be earning limited edition rewards. It's supposedly supposed to be a 48-hour event and start October 31st. At least that's what everything says. All the alerts that keep coming, and alerts, notifications that keep coming, and Twitter. But the in-game timeline says it's going to start tomorrow, which means I'm going to go out and play tomorrow and keep Halloween free, because I'm probably not going to actually finish this. Hi, future zombie. As I'm editing, I realize I got really lucky on the... Halloween event, which you'll see because I'll have the footage right here. Uh, supposedly the basilisk and a couple of the other things that you're supposed to do in the Halloween, Halloween fortress scenario were supposed to be a lot rarer than I think what I got. I had the basilisk maybe like six times, three in a row, right off the beginning. In 20 minutes, I completed the entirety of what the wizarding challenge part of the special event is. And since it continues tomorrow, and it did start today, as in the October 30th, I should have... <laughs> I should be able to finish the rest of it, which is nothing but the dark arts part of it. it easily, and I think it was a lot easier than a lot of people are going to be going through. So really hit up a sponsored fortress because I think that's what basically sold me in completing all the wizarding part of the fortress parts of today's event and tomorrow's event. So the Halloween, I'm going to have a hard time saying that. The Halloween, Halloween, the Halloween, Halloween special is going to include Exclusive rewards, including a new title and a badge for your ministry ID, mm, could be passed. But then at least you get to have the, I did the Halloween thing. Also, you are going to need a lot of dark art rooms. So if you haven't used any yet, don't use any till the event is fully started. And Hopefully it really does start the 30th of October instead of the 31st because I supposed to be 48 hours and everything also says it ends November 1st. So if it starts the 31st, it's not going to end November 1st or it's not going to be 48 hours. As per usual with every event we've had before, there's going to be a free store bundle which will supply you with dark runes and dark runes, dark art runes and spell energy which will be good in case you did use any of your dark arts runes. You now have some. Just, uh, I guess, continue grinding all your dark art foundables to gain more dark runes. Dark art runes. I can't say dark art and runes in one fall swoop. So partnered fortresses, which would be like anyone that goes partnered with blank, 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 offers you a discount. Basically, all the AT&T fortresses will grant bonuses, including an increased chance of encountering Slytherin's Basilisk, bonus Dark Arts Family XP, and increased spell energy in chambers levels 4 and higher. So this is where you're going to want to go a little bit higher instead of, you know, all the normal events just to get the wizard challenges out of the way. And you go with the lower ones. This one is going to be with the higher ones. Not only if you don't have enough dark art runes, increased dark art traces are going to be a thing. It seems like every... Uh, event lately that has to do with finding a very specific type of trace, it tends to be more available than it has been in the past. 
Also, increased Moni Myrtle and young Ginny Weasley traces, which is good. Because I think I still need the entire, I think I still need some fragments left of Ginny Weasley. 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 I'm horrible at this. Use your higher leveled dark art rune stones to face off against dark ministry officials, a dark witch, and Slytherin Basilisk. Hopefully my best friend's going to play. I'd love to see her get this. I'd love to see her get all the special things. I, she hasn't played in a while. So the higher the dark art rune stones you use, the higher and more increased chance of finding and fighting the Slytherin Basilisk. Have enough health potions to get through it. Have enough spell energy to get through it. Hopefully, I'm going to start with my lowest rune stones first and work my way up. Um, I recently gained a couple higher rune stones thanks to my glitch that I was having for the past two events and the antics like here will fix it instead of normal companies where they send you the premium currency just to buy it all over again. They actually sent me what I was missing, which is really nice and a really good customer service. Brava Niantic, brava. I love you. Stay the same, but also give us more. I mean, you do browse the community at Reddit, so you do listen to us. And ways to get rid of certain heart keys would be great. So not only do we have to find the Slytherin Basilisk at the Wizarding Towers fortresses to get the fancy little badge that goes, Hey, I defeated the Slytherin! We also have assignments. We have returned 10 dark art traces. Use two dark art rune stones in the foul in the how oh it's a special chamber that that was not something that was discussed earlier anyways uh use two dark art rune stones in the halloween halloween chamber of the wizarding fortresses defeat three dark witches defeat two dark ministry officials and defeat one basilisk which will receive in order of rewards 200 xp 200 xp three scrolls, two spell books, one restricted section book, plus a ministry ID tile for the Basilisk. So if you cannot complete the Halloween event, it doesn't seem like mm, that great of a thing. The only thing you're getting is bragging rights as like the main focus of it. But you know, I want them bragging rights. I really want the bragging rights. I already got the special assignment bragging rights. I want the Halloween bragging rights. <laughs> Am I that, like, entitled to it? No. Am I probably going to get it? No. And then, as always, you need to start following me on Instagram. Going to a, re a reoccurring of offerings. It's in, in English. I can't remember how to say the first word in Spanish, but I am going to something that our city has been doing for a couple years now, and ofrendas. I'm going to go see some Day of the Dead altars with my friends. So, fun fact. They did talk about having a team, or it works better when you play with more people. Great for people who have friends who play this. I have friends, just not friends who play this, and have never ran into anybody else playing this. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I can do it as a solo mission. If not, I'm screwed and they need to make more community, I don't know, maybe make it a community event. That way people are more intent to find people to go out and play with. You have a couple more days left. Well, while I'm filming this, you have a day left to grind dark art foundables, which I was trying to do, because the more dark art rune stones you have, the more you can collect, or the better chance you have. Um, since one of the tips is, if you have an excess sponsored fortress, play there. Well, I guess I'm going to go to the mall, because that is where I have access to a sponsored fortress. Someone doesn't know how to do math. 
Because I was going to say, try to grind as much as you can, 48 hours. This person goes, you have three days, but only 48 hours. You have three, play all three days. You have 48 hours. Three days, it's not 48 hours. Three days is 72 hours. 48 hours is two days. Upon completion of the entire event, the special assignment, you will receive 20, you will receive 20 gold, which is good. I don't use my gold much, so that's not a problem anymore. And a Halloween event badge for the Ministry ID, which is actually the one I really, really want. I want the one that says, ha, 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 I'm on Halloween all day, every day, because I'm in Halloween all day, every day. I think that's all I can say about the Halloween event. Hopefully, I do have some footage of the event for you instead of the special assignment footage, which you saw at the beginning of this video. Don't, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I am Zombie Kitty. Thank you and have a good night.